men on board. This must be it. Be careful, Bruce. Who knows what the Riddler has up his sleeve? Your interrogation of Riddler's man produced solid intelligence. No sight of the missiles yet, though. They must be here somewhere. All your idiot colleagues, too. Hostages. They appear to be more of Waller's agents. Agents of Vesta and Blake are likely among them, based on what Waller told us. Terrible decisions. Your agency has been on my heels far too long. A good spot for cover. You're relentless. I'll admit it's going to feel satisfying to get my revenge on your predecessors. Even if you're really just a small part of my plan. What are you talking about? You'll see what I mean soon, of course. Wait for it. You might be angry I brought you here, but when they Don't understand want him raising why, an alarm. they'll recognize I'll move my when he isn't looking. <laughs> After all, I am uniquely qualified to see the big picture. It's often a struggle making people see that. <laughs> Careful! I, get I know. Sometimes my methods can appear a little unorthodox. You brought this on yourselves. All of you. You government clods really thought you were smarter than... It's clear you're in desperate need of some schooling. My friends will be here soon. I'd keep your mouths shut until then. Hostages first. When they're safe, I can find the missiles. Targeting online now. Ready, Bruce. Let the hostages go, Riddler. You can't possibly think clunking a few heads is enough to make me roll over. Oversized vermin! Batman! Batman! Agent of Vesta. The floor! It's heating up! I've memorized your playbook, Batman. I know all your shallow tricks. Poor Eli held out longer than I expected, but I knew he'd give me up eventually. All part of the plan. The missiles. Bait. Just like the hostages were bait. I knew you couldn't bear to let these agents die. <laughs> you care too much about the little people. That makes you weak. I saw how you saved Maury. I saw how angry you got about what happened to Fox. 
Don't think my compassion means I won't hurt you. Don't think I won't beat you within an inch of your life. Hard to do that when you're in a cage. Even harder when you're dead. My partners were supposed to be here to see this. I guess I can just show them the bodies. I'm going to ask you three questions. Get them wrong, one of these agents gets torn apart. You won't get away with this. You get them right? This happens! I designed this for you, Batman. The hero who saves people will die knowing he couldn't save everyone. Let's get started. We have a lot to get through. I'm curious to see how you'll handle it all! It's me you want, not Agent Avesta. Let her go! Oh no, she needs to be in there with you. You can handle the sonic blasts, but her... I estimate three blasts at most before her insides rupture. This one should be easy, Batman. Close to the heart. I solved a puzzle box for the Bat. Now I'm dead. And I mean dismembered. Closed casket for sure kind of dead. Who am I? If you know the answer, please say it. My colleagues will die otherwise. Speak up, Batman. Which one of your dead friends am I? Riddler, I swear. I will make you suffer for this. Oh, that's not very clever of you, Batman. Dead wrong. No, please. That wasn't his answer. Abasto, please. Please. Blake! Oh my god, Blake! Number two. Also, completely self-evident. I am black and blue and bleeding from the ears. Who am I? I think... I think he means me. Say it. I need an answer. Just say it. Or click, click, click! Avesta. The answer is Agent Avesta. You got it, Batman! <laughs> Here's your prize! Enough, Riddler. You made your point. Just one more, Batman. And then it'll all be over. I'll distract him. Just get us out of here. I'm the sharpest mind you'll ever meet. The original genius with Gotham at my feet. Who am I? You're Riddler. Riddler's the genius. Well done, Agent. You answered so quickly, you almost deserve not to get the blast. I'll fire one of the missiles. Use the bad cam to make it hard to the cage. And use Riddler's trap to protect Emon and myself from the explosion. I like what you're saying, Agent Avesta, but you're not the one I need to hear it from. Missile armed, ready to fire. Who's the genius, Batman? Who's on top of Gotham now? I want to hear it from you. I am. What are you doing?
impossible! You, you think you're clever, don't you? You... you... Who's the man who's got no time left? The Riddler. Thought you'd get such an easy one right. Those missiles are aimed right at the city. The answer is Batman. Can't be happening. Batman, I... Blake and I tracked Riddler's ship through the Port Authority logs. We thought we could bring him in ourselves. Riddler snatched us straight off the docks. I should have said no. Urged caution. And now... And now my colleagues are... All we did was hand Riddler more hostages. We only made things worse. Not true. I wouldn't have been able to stop him without you. Thank you, Batman. It's good to know we've got Riddler in custody. Despite the cost. It's over, Riddler. Look forward to a padded cell. Is this really a victory for you, Batman? You're the one in cuffs. Yeah, but you're the one that broke your precious rules. You let one agent die to save another. <laughs> well, that can't sit right with you. Can it? Agent Avesta will understand. I had to protect her. Oh, yes. Had to protect the lady. Mm -hmm. Let the gruff government man die. Ooh, what a hero. I pushed the Batman to his limits. Tested his precious code. Uh, and my comrades would have been impressed. I set this all up to show them. I thought they'd back me up, even if they didn't agree. They, they left me here to deal with you alone. They... They betrayed me. Your comrades thought you went too far. I saw their messages. They were afraid your stunts would get my attention. They were right. They'll regret this. All of them. Unless that white-faced prick set me up. Never told them to meet me here. He... he I... They... They 
April, the Pat. <laughs> the Pat. Lock the ship down, and radio for more medics. But... Riddler, is he... Oh, God damn it. I hope it was worth it, Batman. Worth it? Riddler's a damn corpse. One of Waller's agents is dead. We're not getting a shred of usable testimony out of Eli Nabel. Not after you beat him half to death in my custody. You went behind my back with Waller and buried the investigation in the process. This... This is beyond the goddamn pale. What were you thinking? How could you undermine me like that? Well, I'm sorry, Jim. I didn't mean for this to happen. No, I'm the one who's sorry. The trust between us, it's gone. Our partnership is over. No more sharing evidence. No more squad car backup. The GCPD can't support you anymore. We've done so much for Gotham, Jim. Don't break up our team over this. I... I can't work with someone who goes behind my back. And that's all there is to it. I just want to know how we got to such a messed up place. You're supposed to be the one with the answers, Commissioner. Way I see it, Batman took initiative getting a confession from me. You, on the other hand, Gordon, well, you've been two steps behind Riddler from the start. That is not fair. This mess here, that's on you. Batman's had his priorities straight, but you. Now wait a damn minute. Your stonewalling the agency has screwed us all. This is my fault, and mine alone. It's not fair to let Gordon take the blame. <laughs> now you side with me. Don't do me any favors, Batman. I can look after myself. Do as he asks. Right now, we need doers, not complainers. Consider it a kindness I don't just straight up get you demoted. Now leave us alone. We have sensitive case details to discuss. <laughs> you two deserve each other. This city is about to find itself in a crisis the likes of which it's never known. Riddler had a crew. Not just any crew. The worst criminal minds from all over the world, here in Gotham. You come across anything about them? I'm assuming you've heard of them by now. Let me know if you have anything to share. Riddler expected his friends to back him up tonight. Guess he wasn't as popular as he thought. That fits a theory we have. Evidence from his workshop suggests he was involved in a feud with another member of the group. Dr. Harleen Quinzel, former psychiatrist at Arkham Asylum. She's very elusive. Keeps her head down. Much more so than that show-off regular. He was going to be my way in once we captured him alive. But now I have you to lean on. A man who lives on both sides of the line and knows exactly when to cross it. Yes, you and I will be working together very closely. Bruce.